good morning students yesterday we saw the theory part and the exercise a in the chapter models and today we will see exercise b and c so it is in your page 57 and 58 okay exercise b is talking about is doing fill up and exercise c is a type of conversation that allows you to fill up okay so all these exercises are meant to not only apply what grammar you have studied ultimately it helps you to improve your english language grammar the theory part what or you may learn even the teachers without referring a bit looking to the notes a bit they can't teach okay theory part every point we can remember and when we speak english we don't see really what i am speaking am i speaking present tense am i speaking past tense or am i speaking future tense no as you speak it comes to the practice so the exercises are exercises are meant to help you practice english okay so that's why we have more exercises than the theory that way let's enjoy doing this to learn good english to improve language <coughs> now <coughs> in exercise b there are <coughs> clues given like what type of function of the model verbs should be applied in the brackets so in the filler we will write the model verbs now see first one is i can dance well it's talking about capability i can dance well i am not to be selected to the troop second one can you tell me the direction again the bracket it is given suggestion because suggestion normally does not come in the form of question since so a printing mistake you can cut it and write request okay so can you tell me the directions again the second one is right it is a necessity or obligation so use must okay i must reach the destination by 8 pm you see in the same page 57 top there is a box in the right side obligation necessity advice you have must have to should or to any of them you can use it's not necessary you should use only must okay most all of them are equal but some words sometimes apply only in some situation but in this place you can write anything okay now we we'll go to the next one third one you should listen to your elders is an advice okay similarly for all these you have got various model verbs any one you can choose but remember sometimes you have to be polite sometimes you have to be uh very hard in expressing also present tense past these two things you remember uh, other than that you can uh, use any word okay now here you should is obligation or advice whatever it is necessity all come in the same column last column okay fourth one study under dim lights may hurt your eyes uh, may hurt so it may not hurt also but long run it hurts so possibility mehul could run fast when she was younger so it's a past tense 
Du kan rejde Can Rejde only could No possibility You should only use Could Because in past Talking about the past Sixth one Bihu looks tired She must get some sleep So it's an advice Okay Okay. The clue is given so very easy to write the answers. Okay, so now we go to the C. It's a type of conversation between two people. Okay, first one says, "Good morning. How can I help you?" Not ask. How could I help you? Both. Can is formal. Uh, so can is uh, informal. Could is very formal. The second person says, "Good morning." Replies, "Can you direct us how to get to Manali?" Is a request in the question form. First one also. Question form request. Third sentence. Would you like to go by taxi, or would you prefer a bus? Fourth sentence. We would like to go by a taxi. Last fill up. You can find a taxi stand nearby. Possibility. It may charge around five hundred rupees. Hope you have an enjoyable journey. Okay. So. possibilities the conversation ends thank you so much okay so thank you so much all the best